Today we're going to talk about how to upload and download the parameters out of an Allen Bradley PowerFlex 525 drive using the back of the control module. One feature that they have is that you can actually program them without connecting power to them. And hopefully that means that if you have a drive that is bad, you can salvage the parameters out of them. Right here at the top, you're going to see this release button and you're going to want to press it down and then much more forcefully than I think it should take, you're going to want to pull on that afterwards and the whole front of this will pull off. And so what you're left with is the ethernet interface and the control terminals come off and your power, which includes your incoming power and your motor is left there. And if you look at the back of it here, you're going to see a USB interface just like your printer would have. So we're going to take a standard USB A to B printer cable and we're going to plug it in right here. And we're going to plug the other side into our computer. And it doesn't actually power up the drive, although you can see there's a little LED on the side of it that illuminates then. But if you give it a little bit of time, then it's going to come up just like a USB drive would when you plug it into your computer. So go to your start menu and just start typing Explorer. And two things are going to come up, Internet Explorer and File Explorer. We want the File Explorer. And then down at the bottom, you're going to see this removable disk. And then it's going to be two files. You're going to have a guide.pdf, which is going to take you through a really basic summary up the drive parameters. And then you're going to have the pf52xusb.exe file. And that's what we're going to want to open. And then this is a really basic interface. So we have upload, download, and flash. And you can do just that. Now let's make sure we keep our upload download straight. So we upload from a drive to our PC. We download from our PC to a drive. Industrial automation is exactly opposite of the internet. So we click upload, then we can hit next and we'll give it a name. We'll just call it PowerFlex and save. And then we can click the upload button. 